How many pizzas do you make in one shift? I mean, it depends. Like Saturday night, we go to like up to 400 pizza. 400? Yeah, sure. Wow. Okay. 400 like pizzas. Saturday night. Saturday night, 400 pizzas in one night. So these guys, these guys let me back here. I'm kind of in the way, so I don't want to be here too long. But uh, yeah, they're showing me how they make the pizzas. Oh, okay. Seriously, the best pizza I've ever had in my life. I'm trying to keep my voice down because there's a bocce ball tournament. course of Buenos Aires because I'm meeting Pierre here for dinner. We're gonna get some pizza and then no, no, go to bar. It's Friday night. Oh, look at this. Hello, my friend. Good to Hello. see you. How are you? This guy. Buongiorno. Buongiorno a tutti. I told him we we're gonna go out tonight. Andiamo a mangiare una pizza. Let's do it. Pierre just told me that a line here is actually not normal here in Milan. Actually, yes. Here in Milan, usually you don't, you don't, you are not in the line to wait to go to dinner. But actually, this one, this pizzeria, is really good. Worth it? I think so. We'll Nobody's find out. Now. And if it's not, I'm gonna like, punch him in the stomach. Yeah. We'll see if this place is actually worth it. We will see. Let's see it after. We will tell you later. Check this out. Saturday night, 400 pizzas in one night. So these guys, these guys let me back here. I'm kind of in the way, so I don't want to be here too long. But uh, yeah, they're showing me how they make those pizzas. Seriously, the best pizza that I've ever had in my life. So. This restaurant is rated one of the top 50 in all of Italy. I'm gonna give it number one in Milan by far. Best pizza I've ever had in my entire life. I haven't been to Napoli yet, but definitely the best pizza that I've ever had in my life. So. This is the mozzarella di bufala, the typical one, the typical mozzarella of Italy. It really tastes so good. So, um, and we got it for free, yeah? I think so. Maybe. I will pay, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> what It's really loud in here, but we just got a giant ball of pure, fresh, homemade mozzarella. Oh, and another pizza. They're totally hooking us up here. I don't know if it's because Pierre told them I'm a YouTuber or because we're filming everything left and right, but yeah, they're hooking us up. Check out this restaurant. Actually, don't because this is my new place. Pierre, what's going on right now? Guys, they keep bringing food, like we cannot eat anymore, but I like that, you know, like this is Italy, you know, like they, it's like a big family. It's really good. Tiramisu. Literally, our waiter just keeps on coming up to us and saying, Oh, would you like to try some of this? Would you like some of that? Can I bring you this? And we're like, Sure, bring all of it. They literally just keep bringing us stuff. And I have no more space in my stomach. Drinks and desserts and. Uh, 
Ciao, grazie. Ciao. Ciao, grazie. Ciao. the verdict for me one of the best pizza ever that's my opinion as an as, as an Swiss Italian guy for me as a non-Swiss Italian guy as yeah. a as a, an American, as a, an American I'll put that in the vlog exactly. right there for, for me that was the best pizza I've ever had in my entire life and I know that's saying a lot because I lived in New York City I mean you yeah. know that's where I met Pierre I met Pierre in New York City yeah so I lived in New York City that was the best pizza I've ever had in my entire life. Wait, what was the name of that place? Is the name? Should we tell them? Are you ready? This one. To, if you saw it, then you saw it. If you didn't, then I'm sorry. The best pizza spot I've ever experienced in my life. Coming from a Swiss Italian, one of the best places he's ever eaten at, so. I think so. Really, guys, really good. Big thank you to this guy for hooking it up. If you guys like this video, you know what to do. Thumbs up. I love you. Buonanotte. Tisbah al-khair. Buonanotte.